Well, shit. What are y'all doing? This, this is, is awful. awful. I'm Deontay. I'm Jordan. And welcome back to This Is Awful, Jordan's first watch of Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 2. So, did you like it? I did like it, yes. I think that the ending pretty much saved the movie. I mean, it wasn't a bad movie, but all that like stupid humor was really getting on my nerves. But the ending of the movie definitely saved it for me. All the the quibby back and forth and they were reused my my point is not the it's not the jokes it's to the reusing of the jokes like yeah you know like they having this conversation and then somebody says are you really having this conversation right now like they did that like three times in the movie once was yeah. enough move on to the next move on to the next joke Dr uh, drax calling this woman ugly that went on too long for me the one interaction all we need is one <laughs> Although at the end when he was like, it's beautiful <laughs> and so are you on the inside. <laughs> that, that was good. That, that was good. That was good. But they could have done without the other 25 of them. Like, the, I didn't have a problem with this movie. I only saw it once because it, it, it when it, remember when it, when it came out, it didn't, you know, we watching it in a different way. So it didn't, you know, mm -hmm. it didn't hit like that when I watched it because it, it didn't stick because it was like this ain't got shit to do with, yeah. what, with what's going on in the middle of what we've already seen. I don't I care about that. this. And right. on rewatch, I would thought I would, you know, think, oh, maybe it's I don't care about it now. <laughs> to be honest, I don't care. Those gold, those gold people did nothing. I was gonna for say me. the gold people. What I was forgot, their I, point? I forgot. What the, I forgot. What, uh, what, oh shit! I, that's how much I don't. Oh, the so sovereign, sovereign. Yeah, the sovereign. Yeah, that's how much I didn't care about them. They did nothing for me. Like, yeah, because y'all are really this upset. Like y'all, y'all wasting all of your resources on, on these batteries. three little batteries. But the, he I guess it say, was a principle. He did say that. Like, he, he did say that they would they would try to kill you and take offense if you like disrespected them or whatever. So yeah. They, they, but they, so they she said wasted a, everything. They they yeah. went after them once and they got all shot down. Went after them again and got all shot down. Then they sent like every single ship they have. And still got destroyed. I feel like they got. A, they should have like an unlimited amount of those since like they're yeah, since really, they're not really going. Yeah, it's like you should just make more. Just make more holographic <laughs> driving pods or whatever the fuck those things are. You gotta have resources for that though. She didn't wasted all their resources. That's why the other girl came in and was like, "You gotta go talk to the priest or so whatever." whatever. So, what I, so what the fuck are the batteries for? Then just make some more with those <laughs> with those batteries they hoarding. <laughs> they can't because Raccoon got the last three. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it did take was three. They upset about three, three batteries, bro. But I do, I do understand. Um, so just because you know this movie wasn't that you know again since it's not really even you know what you've seen so far, it has nothing. They didn't even bring up Infinity Stones. I mean, they did a little bit with the whole. Uh, you probably didn't see it, but they were like in a split second in his eyes. I think they were infinite and went in Peter's eyes when they. Uh -huh. and it, it was like it was like i think it started with the infinity stones and that's when it burst to all that other shit but even still like oh i didn't know that yeah I, and then like the only mention of infinity stone so like did this feel like it was in continuity with what you've already seen with what your story is so far it exactly. didn't even go with its own first part of the movie exactly it went, it went totally it went to a totally a totally different direction I guess that was just for us to see who Peter's dad was because they put such such an emphasis on that at the end of the last movie. But we. But why couldn't he have something to do with the Infinity Stones? Well, he kind of does. He's celestial, but they didn't. They didn't make it. They didn't make it a point. You know. Oh yeah, because where does he draw his energy from? That light stuff. What the, is that from? That. The, we're not. It has nothing to do with the stones. No, it. It's confusing, and we're we're not gonna get into that because it's it goes so deep. It's like celestials, infinity stones, and it's like who came first, the chicken or the egg, shit like that. Okay. That's like that, and it's like it. You've said enough. Okay, okay, so I'm fine. <laughs> uh, I know it's one thing you weren't confused in this movie, like you didn't ask a lot of no. questions. You were, you kept up. That I was wasn't confused. Um, yeah, I feel like I kept up with it because there were like different stories going on. So we had. Um, 
We had Peter's backstory about his family. We had like Gamora and Nebula's backstory a little bit of why they hate each other. So, so what do you think about Peter's dad giving his mom brain cancer? He deserved everything that came to him for that reason alone. Cause that's just crazy. Like he really don't care about nobody but himself. Well, yeah. Cause he's been Which alone for millions of years. So you kind of, kind of like, and you called it out though. You was already on it. You was like, it's a trap. Like you knew what was up from the get go. Yeah. I knew something was going to be up and I kind of had the feeling that he had something to do with, um, Peter's mom dying because he wanted him back. Mm -hmm. So I had a feeling that he was, he had something to do with it, but I didn't know to what extent, like, how can you just like, that's not, that's not what I see as a God, you know, like they're supposed to be rulers of things and all powerful, but in a good way, he put a tumor in somebody's head. Well, so when, that's you, start, awful. when you say good, <laughs> When you say good and bad, those words are relative to like to gods. Gods are like, I have a mission. They don't see good or bad. They, you know, because it's like I have a mission and I have to do whatever I have to do to get this done. It's not, you know, malice intent. It's just what needs to be done. Even though it was a dick move and I don't agree with it, but he's a god at the same time and they don't think like we think. I guess. But yeah, that's crazy though. He deserved everything that came to him after that. I don't feel bad for none of the stuff that Peter did to him. Did you did you like Yandu's character growth from what we saw in the first movie to now? Oh yeah, for sure. He did, he didn't really hold much significance to me before. Mm -hmm. I just thought he was somebody who steals. Like he steals things, he steals people cuz he stole Peter. But I mean, he did say at the end that he d didn't take him to his dad because his dad was an asshole, but we didn't have anything to go off of. He, back then, asshole, so. asshole was an understatement. He was killing <laughs> kids that he impregnated from all these different women all over the galaxy. Yeah, that's so wild. Yeah, I, that. I, never, I never thought of a god as a hoe either, but. Uh... <laughs> he, he look. Be respectful, okay? Okay, okay. <laughs> he, 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 okay. We, look, we still got to die one day, all right? Okay. Oh. Were you buying any of the the raccoon personal growth with him and Yandu's comparison when he was like, you was just like me, boy. Like, I know what they were I trying mean, to go he, with, but... He's a raccoon. Yeah, it's like, I know what they were going for, but it didn't, like, again, I saw Yandu's character growth, and I saw yeah. Ro Rocket with, you know... It was personal growth for him because he was really the reason all that shit happened. Stealing those batteries when he shouldn't have. But they were yeah. trying to basically say he does the same thing. You know, he pushing people away and all this other shit. And it, I, I knew what they were going for. It just didn't hit like that for me, unfortunately. Yeah, I mean, because he's a raccoon. Because like, he's a raccoon. He, it's like, yeah. But... Which, I mean, I guess it's we shouldn't be saying that because Yandu isn't really a person either. He's an uh, he's alien. A, yeah, but that's different. He's, huh? a, he's a humanoid. He's a yeah. humanoid, but he but he's not a raccoon. Yeah, you're right. I was I wasn't feeling it for the raccoon. I was yeah, it was just it didn't hit like that. Not not for me. Groot, baby Groot was adorable the whole movie. Very More, cute. Very cute. Um, uh -huh. Mantis, did you like Mantis? Because she's gonna be around. Mantis is new new character now, so you'll be seeing um... Mantis. I feel like she could have uh, stopped all of this shit from happening if she just said what she had to say from the very beginning. Right. But I mean, I think she's her okay. And her and Drex, they bounce off each other very nicely with him him being the way he is and she being the way you know, she's naive and he's like direct. Yeah. I think it works. It works. I yeah, have if, no he, if he stops with all this damn sarcasm or whatever whatever they're sarcasm. trying to go for it's not sarcasm for him he's just he's just a very direct person yeah well we we've seen enough of it no i know i like drax i haven't seen enough of it give me more drax give me less mm -hmm. gamora give me less nebula did you like nebula do you like nebula how you feeling about nebula she's a little too angry for me and she has reason for sure she has reason but yeah, I'm does like... she does she because again, like I said earlier, it's me or it's you. 
and yeah. only a strong survive. So I mean, so yeah. it's like she's she's a little too angry for me. I'm like every everybody that talks to her, she got to go off on a whole long tangent and speech about how her childhood was terrible. It's just like, yeah, okay, we get it. Oh, you mean when she was going off old boy about when he asked her what you gonna buy with that money, and she started going yeah. about killing Thanos? He was like. Like, I bro, was I thought you was gonna say a necklace, necklace or something. You thought about killing Thanos? I don't want to be part All of this right. conversation, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave. <laughs> yeah, you do what you gonna do. You don't. She, you don't need to be that angry towards everybody. Yeah, that's true, but you know, she that that character that character type you see them throughout like all type of. You know, oh yeah. So, yeah, they just mad at the world, and then they, and then, then she'll come around at the end, got a little, got a little huggy hug, and then you know, yeah, that was it. But she about that smoke though. I like that. She about that action. And Rocket, he, yeah, that's true. Rocket, Rocket kind of turned up too uh, in the forest. Oh yeah, he was kicking ass. Yeah, that was, was pretty ass. cool. Yandu with his arrow, Yandu was kicking ass. Yeah, everybody, everybody kicked ass except Gamora. I just do not like that character for some. Yeah, what? Way. What did she do this movie? Nothing. She Absolutely wouldn't even admit nothing. to her little her love for uh, Peter until he was about to die. So. Right, I hate when, I hate when they do that. Like, but don't look, don't love me. Look, you you fake just like all the rappers say. It's all love. Yeah, Man, you don't want me while I'm alive, but then when I die, all of a sudden you got love for me and shit. Nah, I'll keep that fake. Yeah, love. Love even me. trying to say it the whole movie they had something going on and she kept saying nah, and now all of a sudden when she thinks he's about to be. Uh, nah, she got jealous. turned into dust. She got jealous when that gold lady was asking for some. Dick right in her face. <laughs> so we got to we got to do it the way y'all used to do it. You know what I'm saying for educational purposes. All right. So before we get out of here, just like all the other movies we've done, what have you rated this movie? Was there anything awful about this movie that you just hated? Um, not really. No, not really. other than the humor that we keep saying that was about it but i like the whole story i you see i didn't fall asleep once so it well, kept my interest well i actually did catch you falling asleep i'll show you the video i did not fall asleep okay, i was not falling asleep at all in okay, this movie don't okay. even okay i'll show you don't worry I, I, don't worry i saw you because i looked at you the whole time too i'm gonna show you soon i was not falling asleep what the fuck do you rate this movie <laughs> Um, have I given any of them an eight yet? If you give this movie an eight, we're done watching the <laughs> movies. Please say eight. It Make my day. <laughs> if you don't want to watch, if you don't want to watch anymore, that's all you have to say. Say Talk eight. about make my day. Say eight, and I will turn I'm this shit upside down. I promise you. I'm gonna give it a seven. I think it was a good movie. I liked it. I enjoyed it. And it kept my attention the whole time. I give it a seven. Why are you the way that you are? I mean, honestly, <laughs> every time I try to do something fun, you make it not that way. I despise what do you so much of the things that you choose to be. What do you want from me? <laughs> You I, asked me for a rating. Yeah, but seven? Seven? What do you rate it? This movie is a solid five at best. Why? It, it has, has no, action. It has no, number one, it has no replay uh, ability at all. I've never gone back and watched this movie again, and I'm not going to. Would you want to watch this movie again for the second time? I would watch this one again over the first Guardians of the Galaxy. We'll see y'all in uh, the next one, Avengers Age of Ultron. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we will see y'all in the next one. Fucking seven. You got anything else? I'm afraid to say anything else. Bye, y'all. <laughs>